clips hey guys we have been working since the last time you saw us down here in Glenda's basement and this is what we did we cleaned out this room right here uh, took that desk out on the side over there I'm looking at where's the light switch in here that's the only light in here ah! needs to be oh we gotta switch out that light. oh okay so glenda hooked these up over here we took uh, took out that and then this is the carpet we are pulling up the carpet right here and so what's that right there piece is that okay from that corner oh oh okay girl we in here looking like a third world third world house <laughs> We done pulled it up to the sticky, sticky, wicky, wick. Um, or do we need to just, it's, yeah, roll it. Let me put this up and then help you roll that. What's going on out here, Glenda? Girl, trying to move this stuff out of the way to get to the wagon. The wagon? <laughs> to take the stuff to the road? I bought a wagon. A wagon? A real little kid's wagon? No, it's a, it's a utility wagon. Alrighty. Where's the wagon? It's right here. Oh, there it is. It's not red. I was expecting a red wagon. Oh. It's black. It's so cute. We got to get the dragon, guys. We got to get the dragon. that you plan to install 
the four planks. Now, cut the underlayment oh, with the oh, utility. I got, I, got, I got a question. Uh -huh. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, start in a corner of the room yeah. by rolling out the underlayment with the overlap flat and adhesive strip facing up. Mm -hmm. And that's correct. That's correct. Okay, now, run the underlayment parallel to the wall and in the opposite direction that you plan to install the floor. So in other room. words, if the planks are coming this way, right. then that's right. Otherwise, that's right. I need to turn this around. That's correct. So that the planks will be going this way. Right. And I think we should run the planks along. I think so too. Okay. Okay, now. Can you guys see the blue Glenda is sitting on? That's called underlayment. And that goes on top of where, on top of the floor. And the laminate is going to go on top of that. So that's why the carpet had to come up because that the laminate had to go down. Well, we didn't want to do it then. It makes sense to me. Yeah. Feel your floral. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that carpet, it wouldn't have made a difference. No, the carpet would have cracked more. Okay. And this will go now because, you know, it has to go. Yeah. However, the floor down here should not be wood because moisture and wood does not get along. Right. So we're doing the um, downstairs with the um, Laminate. Okay. So that it does not, it is not affected by my hot tub moisture. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, guys. Linda's putting down the laminate floors already. Y'all see them? Let's go walk a little bit closer. And we are, she's snapping these together. Boom, 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 boom. So the next time I show you guys, the floor will be done. Ooh, ooh. Hey guys. Hey guys. It's Claudia. And Glenda. And we are about to have lunch in the Soul Delicious restaurant. I Glenda keeps saying, don't you remember? I don't, don't remember. remember. So delicious. It's good. I, I like it because I get to pick out vegetables. Really? Maybe a meat or so. <laughs> I don't. I love the name. So delicious. Soul, S O U L, guys. But, but so um, it's so delicioso. 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 Glenda, Glenda, are you having some trouble also today with your. I am. That's crazy. <laughs> some trabajo. <laughs> Yeah, I, I got up this morning and, and I had a thought about Martha's Vineyard. So I put on my Martha's Vineyard shirt. Really? Yeah. Let's see it. Oh, God. I love this shirt. Yeah, there we go. Bam. Wow. Because I, I love visiting Martha's Vineyard and it's so nice. It was beautiful. It was incredible. And we weren't vlogging we were then. Incredible. No, we so, weren't. But we got to go back again. We have to go And back. stay a week. I love or it. Or two weeks. That would be great vlogging Martha's mm -hmm. Vineyard. That was awesome, guys. But anyway, let me turn this camera around and show you the opening of the restaurant. Uh, not the opening, the entrance.
just left Soul Delicious restaurant. It was great. The food was good. My sister did not like the curry goat. Oh my god. Bah ha ha. Something about the woo. It was something about the um, maybe the wild taste. But it was crazy. I like it because I don't eat the beef, the pork, or the chicken, or the turkey. So that little bad hat hat was just good enough. <laughs> oh, we gotta get out the way. Oh, wait, wait, <laughs> wait. <laughs> Sorry, we're about to get run over. <laughs> so wait, so wait, Glenda. So what did you say about the cake? So I told my sister, I said, I want to take some of these cakes with us. And the little Demarcus, he said, you can take them home it's to so go. Sweet. But I felt kind of bad because you're not used to getting up, leaving a restaurant and taking your cake. So I <laughs> Not said, several you... slices. I know. So I was like, can you stuff these in your purse? But my purse was way too little. And then I choose to tell her, don't squish it. With the man behind us. With the manager sitting at the next table behind us. I'm like, what the hell? Hey. It was fun, though. We had fun. It was fun. Delicious. And I, you all better not say I look like Bozo the Clown. <laughs> if she looks like Bozo, then I think I look like Ho Ho Ho. <laughs> Those old fools are tick like Santa. <laughs> no. <laughs> Bozo and Ho Ho Ho. my hair is standing back. <laughs> oh my God. It's just everywhere here. <laughs> oh, she's going to get <laughs> So we're going to take our cake and um, we're grateful. Yes, we are. Such Thank you, Glenda, for our breakfast, brunchy, lunchy, lunchy. <laughs> and uh, Demarcus was a great waiter, so yes, it's so was. delicious. Look for Demarcus. Yes, he's a great guy. A absolutely. Now we're gonna go take up Glenda's floor. Yeah, because I fired my Spaniards. <laughs> Wait a minute. For the floors. Oh my God. They were, they were sweet though. Very sweet. But they still had to go. Yeah. So some sweet things. Toodles, toodles. Have to go. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. We yeah. saw a little girl who's a YouTuber. And I was her second subscriber. Her mom was probably the first. Oh, wow. <laughs> little brother didn't even subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it might have been a little brother who was the other subscriber. I know. All I know is I'm so glad that I subscribe because I think it gives her hope. Always. And we want to keep hope alive. Always. Someone said that in history. Who was it? Uh, Jesse Jackson. Keep hope, keep hope alive. Even as his dwindle. I know. Hey. I mean, he was hey. keeping holes alive, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Jesse, but I'm telling the story. <laughs> okay, guys. We are going to head to the hizzy. Yeah, we have work to do. Mm. Yeah. Maybe story times will come later. Yeah, we're gonna, we, <laughs> we have to do some renovations on my house because we're about to transform our downstairs in the basement into a haven of happiness. Yes. Like this hot tub that's coming at the end oh, of the month. Party over at Glenda's. The floors ready. We're having a birthday party in November. Party at Glenda's. It's gonna be really nice. Yes. So, that's what we're gonna do now. We gotta go get it all done. I'm down with that. Alrighty. Okay, guys. Oodles. Bye. Bye. <laughs>